If I told you so, were a person. Real Housewives of Miami, star Gerdi Abrera feels vindicated after watching her co-stars offer Lisa Hochstein the same divorce counsel the event planner initially tried to give their pal. My advice stuck because I said to her, it's you and your kids, move on, focus. Abrera, 45, told Page Six of Evan Real and Danny Murphy during Friday's live taping of the virtual reality podcast presented by Tri-State Cadillac. And so all the other girls all of a sudden are now saying, oh my god, yeah, you should just be you and the kids. I'm like, yeah, Ben said that. The Bravo Liberty's husband, Russell Abrera, who was on stage beside her at City Winery in New York City, proudly interjected, Gertie had it right from the moment they mentioned it. The Haiti-born mother of two added that she's all about progressing in life, and called Hochstein, an amazing woman. She's gonna be alright, she insisted. She's got this, she's good. The moment a tearful Lisa, 40, revealed to her castmates that her husband, Drive, Lenny Hochstein, had asked her for a divorce and was already dating someone new, Gertie launched into an impassioned speech about how Lisa needed to let go of the idea that her family included Lenny. She encouraged the Canadian to prioritize herself and her two young children, son Logan, 7, and daughter L3, above trying to keep her already doomed marriage together. Larsa Pippen was the most vocal in urging Gertie, who's been married to Russell for more than 20 years, to pipe down because she had never experienced divorce. In fact, Larsa was famously married to NBA legend Scottie Pippen for almost the same amount of time. The pair finalized their divorce in January 2022. People like to add to chaos and confusion when they don't want to acknowledge your strength in the group, Gertie told Page Six. But soon, they will. Stay tuned for, next season, baby. She also branded Larsa, 48, the fakest, housewife, on their show. The wedding guru previously admitted that the Hochstein split after nearly 13 years of marriage made her and her co-stars re-examine their own relationships. It shook me, she told us in December 2022. And that's where my story goes on a personal level with my own husband. I'm just kind of looking around, like, okay, if this can happen so fast and furious, am I okay at home? New episodes of Page Six, a virtual reality podcast are released Thursdays.